Hello, my name is Kenya Mefole and uh, I was born in Nigeria and I came over here in uh, 1981 uh, for school. I went to University of Washington. I've been with Grace for about six years and uh, I have uh, five children and a beautiful granddaughter. I have a BA in English, a BS in clinical psychology. I went back and did my nursing, a master's in um, healthcare administration and a master's in nursing also. When I first came over here, I was eating uh, at the cafeteria at the UW. There was a lady that kept looking at me, came to me and said I had pretty uh, cheekbone and she wanted to introduce me to an agent. As God will have it, um, I got uh, casted into commercials. I had a few commercials and I even had small parts in two movies, House of Games and uh, Divorce Wars with Tom Selleck. So that's how I paid my way through the university. Well, I was raised Catholic. I was never used to um, having a Bible or reading the Bible or even sharing the Bible. A friend invited me to, uh, to their church. When I got there, I was amazed that as the pastor was reading the Bible, people actually had Bibles in their hands and following. That really amazed me. When I got out of there, I was, I was very, very enlightened. I was very, very happy. And my friend gave me my first Bible. Out of curiosity, I started reading my Bible, finding out all those things that uh, we were taught. Um, when I came to Grace, boy, uh, it was a wonderful thing because yes, we read the Bible, we study the Bible, we talk about it. It's very fulfilling. When you're so focused on God's words, the devil finds ways to uh, try to stop you. I went through a difficult divorce, and then in 2003, two days after I had climbed the Columbia Tower for uh, leukemia, uh, Fred Hodge leukemia and lymphoma for charity, I went to work. I was um, working as a nurse practitioner in trauma center. I was walking down the hallway and that was the last thing I remembered. And my heart stopped beating. They brought my heartbeat back and it went away. They brought it back, it went away three times and I woke up with a pacemaker and defibrillator. That's how I've been living now since 2003. And God has been good and I thank God for everything because He has always been there for me. He has always, always taken care of things for me. And like my, my friend the pastor said, stop fighting alone. Give all your burden to God. And I tell you, each and every time I've done that, each and every time I've done that, I've come out victorious. So you see me smiling, you see me laughing and chatting and looking happy. It's because the Lord has sustained me. And what is a better way to give, to give thanks to the Lord than to pass it on, pass on the, uh, the, uh, the happiness to others. That's why you see me out there. I uh, love to meet people. I love to direct people to whatever they need. I love to pray with people when they need prayers. I love, I love to encourage people and telling people, hey, if Jesus has done it for me, Jesus can do it for you too. <laughs>